final girl. And that is what we shall get. I like to imagine this is right as Max, like, Laura! spawns as a human. It's like, I don't know what's going on! Why am I outside? Why am I in a tree? Why am I covered in blood? I have so many questions. I'll just steal this girl's clothes. How'd she get her underwear back? Oh wait, she's not a werewolf like me. Where the hell am I? Oh yeah. He knew where he was. He's like, oh yeah, I'm here. And Max, look at my underwear. That I grow when I become a non vamp werewolf. I almost said vampire again. Where the hell are my clothes? Vamp wolf. Vamp. Vamp wear. You gotta be kidding me. It could have been so much worse. Max could have been wearing like a halter top. Okay. And why does this shirt matter, like, to be honest? If, if Max is walking around in, like, no shirt and just pants, a little bit better than wearing, like, a girl's top, clearly. And some leggings. <laughs> like, he's wearing, like, girl pants. At least the clothes fit him. They could not fit him at all. He could just be like, I can't even zip this. Oh no, it was a full moon. That's me. There's me in the corner. <laughs> I didn't know like how he saw any of that because she died inside. Very clearly, like in the place. Like she opened the thing and she died. But that's cool, whatever. Yeah, Max was like, ah, 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 and he like nom 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 nommed. That's what happened. <sighs> bing, 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 bing. I'm Max, and I'm wearing women's clothes. Did you know I could whistle? I didn't know I could whistle. Just kidding. I knew I could whistle. As, as someone who has gotten into very cold water recently. <laughs> Alright, let me get my notes. Let's 
go. Okay, nice. Hopefully they realize the camp is closed and try the motel up the road. So I was making sure I knew what I was doing here. All right, got it. Got it pulled up. Thank you, Game Rant, for providing the necessary information. I don't trust IGN anymore because it has successfully lied to me many times. I just want to get this trophy and get this over with. So let's go. How long has this guy been here? All the years, Caitlin. He's been here all the years. Prepare for attack. I really do have a question, though. If I shoot... Caleb, wouldn't that also make Caitlyn survive the night? Motherfuckers. Up, 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 up. All right, so we got run, beam, compute, complete QT, run, successfully hold breath, freezer, use decoy, QT. Hard, hard, hard. Oh, Caleb, ah, Caleb, busting in. He doesn't care about his ancestral past. Busting through the face. All right, here we go. All right. Just <laughs> that jump is so dumb. He's like, I got you! Caleb, you're a child. You do not got me. go that way I see that makes sense cuz I was like why like how's that make sense like Dylan is always in here but I guess because he's not I got a Jurassic Park it
I worked. <laughs> Got it. Lady, I don't care. I don't care about your son. I just, I, I just, I just it's been an it's interesting, been an interesting night. The cycle continues, for some at least. I have to admit, you've disappointed me, but not as much as you could have done. We're bonded now, you and I. And though the full moon will come again and the curse remains, this night is over. Don't worry. I'll never forget what you did here. But don't you dare ever step foot in Hackett's quarry again. If I see you poking your nose where it doesn't belong, I will never stop haunting you. Wherever you go, I'll be right behind you. The breath on your neck always just... Dude, Bobby can shoot Travis? What the... Wait, 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 Bobby can shoot Ryan? Doesn't kill Ryan after the ladder shoots Travis. Okay. What? Sorry, I got distracted with dogs in the picture. Ladder, final girl! Weird that I saved Constance. Hey, Dad! You can save Wrinkly Face Lady! <laughs> Bodies pile up after summer camp massacre. Just kidding.
Last man standing time. Have you been there before? The scrapyard? Nah. Just seen the sign on my way to camp. What if we just, like, walk to the main road? This isn't the main road? No, this is all Hackett property. The main road is another mile that way. Wait, how do I know so much more about everything than you do? Wait, shut up. So basically, it's another hour walk to the main road, and then at least another three to four hour walk until we hit the nearest whatever? Me yeah. walking at one mile an hour? What was that? Nobody walks that slow. Just keep moving. Half your time, I said 30 minutes for a mile. So, and that's like. I guess this is me now. Slow. What? You're gonna look great with a hook. We can call you Hooky McHook Face. Nobody's ever gonna treat me the same, are they? Some people won't, but fuck them. Would you date a guy with one hand? I don't think it's me you're concerned about, is it? Yeah, I think I'm gonna need a little me time to figure out the new Dylan before anything. New and improved Dylan. Dylan 2.0. Oh, well shit, now I want to be Caitlin 2.0. Hey, find me something sharp enough at the scrapyard and we can make that happen. <laughs> oh, well, now's your chance, buddy. We're here. Oh shit. Relax, it's motion sensor. We're okay. I think. Oh look, steampunk's back in. Ew, come on, this way. Put me down! Easy, ma. Put me down, you old witch! Blow your fucking head up! Everybody just relax. Can't shoot what you can't see, darling. <laughs> the eye roll. Gotcha. Look at what you did to my Kaylee. She's gone. Little Bobby. Mom's gone. Cute. Yeah. No more party. No more protecting anyone. Travis. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Ah, ah. Ah, OK. 
Okay. All right, that's not good. Howdy, darling. We ain't playing games no more, little girl. Try me, motherfucker. <laughs> You know something? I ain't got enough silver to kill you, but I sure to hell can make you suffer.
You gotta help me. I do? Yeah, I promise. I won't tell anyone anything. No, man. Family first. Besides, I'll get in trouble. <laughs> Ow! You stabbed me! Yeah, fucking hurts, don't it? I ain't never been stabbed before. <sighs> Leave me alone. Ow, it... It really hurts, Dad! Dad! Laura. Hey, hey, hey! It's me, it's me! What the fuck happened to you? Oh, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. Oh, Ryan! Oh, how bad is it? I'm so sorry. <sighs> that bad, huh? I keep trying to fix it. Whatever this is, people keep getting hurt. First Max, how you? It's not your fault. I didn't have to come here. I shouldn't have let you come. Uh, you're not the boss of me. Sorry. It's okay. Am I dying? You've lost a lot of blood. But it'll, it'll heal though, right? Wait. Maybe it, maybe it will. What? Ryan, if you let me bite you. What? If you let me bite you, it means you'll be infected, which means. Which means it will heal. Yeah. But it also means... Yeah, yeah, I got it, Big Bad Wolf. Yeah. <sighs> Ryan, I don't have much time. I can feel it like it's fighting to get out. If you let me bite you and you heal, then... Then I have to kill Chris. It's, it's not killing Chris, it's killing a werewolf. 
It's saving your own life. And mine. And Max's and your friend's, too. Let you bite me. And live to kill Chris Hackett. Or bleed out and die. Pretty much, yeah. It's your call, for now. So we doing this or no? Do it. Okay. Uh. Nice and tender for you. He should start to feel better soon, I guess. You guys never throw anything out, huh? So, do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped of parts. Just empty frames and chassis, which doesn't help us much. Okay, so we're looking for... engines? Well, anything relatively intact. Got it. Documentary. No, shut up. Come on, let's go. I ripped a page out. <laughs> I missed old prologue and I got upset and I didn't want to scratch it out, so. Oh, I missed the shot. <laughs> I get that paper in a second. Here's <laughs> Ryan's. Her Ryan's like chainsaw massacre effectively on ah! Dylan's shirt. Sorry, that was scary. <sighs> That's so annoying. We are being hunted by literal monsters. And this is what bothers you? Yeah, both are bad.
So, you ever operated a crane before? I actually used to be pretty, pretty good at the claw game at my local arcade. The kids used to call me the grabber. No, no, uh-uh. Uh oh, I hear that now. Look, why don't you see if you can lower it down so I can take a look under the hood? Sure, yeah, sure thing. Um, just uh, watch my back, yeah? Yeah. All right. Looks like somebody's mom never taught them how to clean up after themselves. Okay, let's see what we're working with. All right, not too complicated. Come back, grabber. Now you're falling away, will you? What the hell is going on? My bad. Uh, it appears the song is playing loudly. All right. Here goes nothing. You did it! Yeah, uh, I think I found my calling. About time! <laughs> well, maybe we can see if we can try and get this thing running. <gasps> Score! Oh shit. All the arms. Getting through there in a hurry. Man, this place is huge. I might need to rest a bit. You'll feel better soon. Cool. I'm feeling pretty good, actually. What are you doing? Stop it. 
Do you smell that? No. Never mind. Let's just find another way down. A way to Chris Hackett. Or just a way out, maybe. I'm done being chased and stabbed. Sure. And another way out. Fine. Watch your step. Yep. What was that? I think... I think we found Chris Hackett. We, we can still save the others. It doesn't have to go down this way, man. Please. Jesus Christ. Last man standing. I'm so glad you're back, especially now that more vermin have been stamped out. A few stragglers remain, but there's still time. So, then, what more has been found? Shall we take a look? That was your last chance. I can't help you anymore. You're on your own.
How the hell am I gonna get down? Asked an answer. Where the hell are my clothes? You gotta be kidding me. Okay. Gotta find Laura. They realize they kept his clothes and tried them out to up the road. Okay. Okay, Caitlin. The rain's been off and on all night. These fuckers know you're in here. They're coming back first chance they get. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Okay. I need to get to a vantage point.
How long has this guy been here? Showtime, motherfuckers. And there you have it. Right at an hour, we've completed both. Two trophies. It's been an interesting night, wouldn't you agree? The cycle continues, for some at least. I have to admit, you've disappointed me, but not as much as you could have done. We're bonded now, you and I. And though the full moon will come again and the curse remains, this night is over. Don't worry. I'll never forget what you did here. But don't you dare ever step foot in Hackett's quarry again. If I see you poking your nose where it doesn't belong, I will never stop haunting you. Wherever you go, I'll be right behind you. The breath on your neck, always just out of sight. If you ever come back, I will haunt you until the day you die. which I'm working on a list of her right now. Uh, fast start to Nick. Jacob tells him the truth. In fact, every character has the don't breathe event. Don't miss any combat encounters. And that's it. And we're done. So. Nice. Solo. Oh, 
She never had on. Oh, there you have it. Bodies pile up after summer camp massacre. What do you make of that, Anton? What do I make of that? Why are they putting the bodies in a pile? They should respectfully bury them, or... Well, you know, at one point, the way to respectfully uh, bury people was to put them in a pile and set it on fire, called a pyre. What does pyre mean, if not a pile fire? Anyways, I'm pretty sure that the pile they reference is metaphorical. And I'm, I'm pretty sure. I really hope it is. Yeah, that would be shoddy detective work. I thought we'd done the whole Hackett's Quarry thing. Not this Hackett's Quarry thing. What was this, like three months ago? Old news, dude. Anton, 